This video will provide a general introduction to EpiReviewer Web, with a particular focus on how it differs to EpiReviewer version 4. EpiReviewer Web uses the same data as EpiReviewer 4, but it cannot work in Internet Explorer. Instead, ERWeb works with modern browsers such as Firefox, Safari and Chrome. It is a pure web application and is based on the same technology used for Gmail and Google Docs. Once you log into to ERWeb, you are taken to the welcome page. From here, you can create a new review or click on any of your previously created reviews. This is the review homepage. From here, you can import references, manage duplicates, as well as import and edit coding tools. The review home also shows how many included and excluded items are in your review. It also shows how many you have deleted and how many duplicates were removed. From here, you can also see your other reviews by expanding the My Reviews panel, as well as your coding assignments in the My Work panel. You can also expand the Sources panel to view a list of sources in the review. The home page also provides an overview of the review coding tools, including a list of complete and incomplete items. By clicking on a coding tool, the number of items coded per user is clearly shown in blue. Clicking on one of these blue numbers will take you directly to that list of items. You might notice that your codes do not appear automatically anymore. To access them, simply click on the green Codes button on the right-hand side. As ERWeb works on touch devices, you can't right-click to edit codes anymore, which is one of the main differences to version 4. Instead, simply click on Edit Tools at the top. To return to the previous screen, click on Close Back at the top right. To find items assigned to a specific code, click on the code and then click on With this code. A particularly useful feature of ERWeb is the inbuilt contextual help on each page. Simply click on the blue Help button at the top of each page and useful information for that particular page will be shown. If you have any ideas on how we can further improve ERWeb, please click on the Feedback button at the top of the page and send your ideas through. Please note that this feature should not be used for asking for help. Instead, please email us at episupport at ucl.ac.uk.